Measures of central tendency, ito na yung mean, median, and mode. Measures of central tendency are numerical descriptive measures which indicate or locate the center of a distribution of a set of data. So, alibawa, we have mean, median, and mode. By definition, yung mean is, uh, is considered the most popular and most widely used. It is it generally described as the center of gravity. So, alibawa, we have a, a pulchrum. Kung nasaan yung nasa gitna niya para mabalance yun, yun yung tinatawag na mean. So, alimbawa, we have set of data. Alimbawa, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, you, ju you just have to uh, locate the center nun. Diba? Ang center nun is um, 5 and 6. Diba? So, ang mean niya is 5 plus 6 over 2 or 5.5. Yun yung mean. Hindi siya yung average over 2. Ha? So, yun. So, median defined as a score point which divides a rank distribution into two equal parts. It is the value which lies 50% of the data. So, meron tayong example for that. Last is mode, the value which we observe to have the highest frequency. Ko alin yung nauulit? Halimbawa, may sumagot ng 50 na tatlo. So, yung frequency nyo, di ba tatlo? So, yun nga, yun yung mode nun. Mean. Meron tayong uh, population mean at saka sample mean. Yan yung, um, tandaan nyo na lang, yan yung formula. So sum of all deviation of all measurement is zero. It can be calculated for any numerical data. It always exists. Set of data has only one mean. It lends itself to higher uh, statistical treatment and most reliable. Use if data are interval or ratio, uh, ratio and when normally distributed. So, weighted mean, uh, halimbawa ito, uh, di ba, meron tayong subject, grade, at saka unit. Get the grade point average or GPA, para lang siyang jiwa, of a particular student whose grades are as follow. So, ang nangyari, yung grade natin na 4.0 times yung unit na 3 plus 2.0 sa English times unit na 3 plus 1.0 sa accounting times 5 units plus 1.5 sa PE times 2 units over yung total number of units. That is 3 plus 3 plus 5 plus 2. And overall, that is equal sa 2.0. Yan yung tinatawag natin na weighted mean. So, ganun lang. Kahit sa GWA, ganun pa rin naman mag-solve niyan. So, weighted mean, pwede siyang gamitin sa Likert type questions. So, this type or yung Likert type questions are used if the researcher wants to know the feelings or opinions of the respondents regarding any topic or issues of interest. So, meron siyang choices, like yung 5 is strongly agree, 4 is for agree, yung 3 is for neutral, 2 is for disagree, and 1 is for strongly disagree. So, yun, parang 4, and yun, ganon, mga, mga ganong Likert type question. So, ito naman yung parang sample siya ng table na may 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 or Likert type question. Kung paano natin to interpret, alibawa sa number 1, ang tanong, I am sure that I can learn statistics. So, yung sumagot, 36 na sumagot ng 5, 51 ang sumagot ng 4, uh, 18 yung sumagot ng 3, at 0 yung sumagot ng 2, then 1 yung sumagot ng 1. So, balikan natin kanina yung weighted mean. Diba ang, ang example natin dyan is uh, ito. Okay, ita times mo lang siya dun sa frequency. So, 36 plus, uh, times 5 plus 51 times 4 plus 18 times 3 plus 0 times 4 plus 1 times 1 over yung total responses. Yun yung ating weighted mean. Okay? And so on so forth. Yung SX naman or yung ating deviation ay makikita over um, that uh, total ng or average ng mean. Yung mean interpretation, alimbawa, we have scale na yung tawag dyan. So, 1 to 1.79, strongly agree. 1.80 to 2.59, disagree. 2.60 to 3.39, neutral. 3.40 to 4.19 agree, and then 4.20 to 5 is strongly agree. So the formula for finding the mean for group data, yung kanina, meron din naman yung uh, population mean at saka sample mean. Dito group data yung tinatanong. So siguro, um, tingnan nyo muna yung mga formula, and as time goes by, 
um, magbigay tayo ng mga example for that. So this time, introduction muna tayo sa measures of central tendency. We also have class mark formula. Ayan. And then, eto, meron pala tayong example. So below is a frequency distribution of the scores of 40 students. The first step is to get the class mark and then get the fx. Okay? So, ito, yung uh, class mark, pwede siyang mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Meron siyang class interval. So, 16 to 23. Then, may frequency kung ilan yun. Tapos, yung x na makukuha mo dyan. And then, Yung uh, weighted mean is yung x times the frequency. Yan, yung 19.5 times 1, 27.5 times 3, 35.5 times 6, 43.5 times 12, 51.5 times 10, 8 times 59.5, that is 476. Then, i-total mo, isasam mo lang siya. Okay? So, ito yung formula for that. So, 1,828, uh, 1, yan yung uh, summation ng weighted mean over the total number of responses, number 40. So, that is equals to 45.7. Please verify to your calculator. Median properties, it is the score or class in a distribution which 50% of the score fall and above with which another 50% lie, not affected by extreme or deviant values. Appropriate for extreme or deviant and use when data is ordinal. So, ito naman, yan yun. So, if uh, for ungrouped data, just arrange data in order of magnitude. So, madaling kunin yung median, di ba? Kasi, halimbawa, dyan sa example, yung nasa baba. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. So, yung median niya is 19. Kasi, yun yung nasa gitna. Kapag add. Pero kapag even, yung median niya is uh, divided by 2. Okay, so parang hindi, um, ayun, median. So, pa-correct na lang. Parang ito yung nasabi ko kanina dun sa mean. Next is mode properties. It is used when you want to find the value, which of course most often. Quick approximation of the average, and then it is the inspection of average, most unreliable among the three measures of central tendency because its value is undefined kasi. Diba? So, halimbawa, ito, uh, the ages of five students are 17, 18, 23, 20, and 19. No mode yun. The grades of five students are 4.0, 35.0, na ulit yung 4.0, another 3.5, and 1.0. So ang mode is 4.0 and 3.5 kasi na ulit yung kanilang frequency or na ulit siyang sinabi. The weights of five person in pounds are 117, 218, 233, uh, 120 and 117 and the mode is 117 for your activity number four answer the quick survey then interpret interpret natin siya during our next meeting so ito yung link testmos.com slash a054206